Hello everyone, it's Cam here. Welcome to Let's Play, Lone Show, Ocarina of Time. Last time, we got the Mighty Long Shot at the being Dark Link, which essentially is a upgrade to Hookshot. Now, just listen to you guys. The easy way to be Bart the way to be Dark Link is that you have to use Moose the not see targeting. Just slash your sword without using the targeting. That's how you beat them. Now you use Master Sword too, but the Gunner Sword do be more effective. You all use Inspire to be Dark Link. Alright, that's so easy to Dark Link. Anyway, this time we get the boss key. And of course, move on to the boss. So yeah. A lot of stuff for you today, alright? Here we go. Last section of the water temple. Here we go. So here it is. The last section of the water temple. Let's just say some check lights. Or maybe we just use our trusty iron boots. Wait, hold on. That work. Okay. Yeah, let's say it'll work because, yeah. I also mentioned the water is moving. I remember, I thought they could go underwater. Oh, there's the, like, on me. No way, Mr. Tech Tanks. Okay, better get out of the water because these things are gonna stalk me if I don't. No, no! Come on. Jeez! I you offering for some reason? Okay, thank you for doing that because even unless you have done that, I wouldn't be coming out of this. Alright. Let's just get out of the water, please. Alright. Still a tech tight! Come on! Stop knocking me into the water, please! For God's sakes! My God! Are you trying to rape me? My God! What the heck? That was a weird case of tech tight rape. Okay. All right. Let's move on, shall we? Oh, this room. <gasps> hey, remember the stairs from the, um, the air temple? Well, they're back here. The stairs are back now, and they're... Whoa! They can just go out of the water, apparently. Let's get rid of them, because... We'll worry about it later. Come on. Gotcha. Die. I'm just in here. Die. Thank God we got rid of them. Hmm. This wall seems suspicious. Yep. Bomb it. Oh, in this wall right here. Why, it's a box. A block. Hmm. Maybe. Is it very carefully? Aha! There's a wall on the other side, huh? Anyway. You see? See what some of this puzzle is? Boom. Okay. Seriously, I just cannot believe what happened last, in just a few minutes ago. I was like... All those tags were like, spawning on my butt. So yeah, I think I gotta yeah, use your arrows. Then take them out before you go out and, well... Do things. Anyway, may I guess you need to push this block all the way over to that switch. My god. Sorry guys, I just can't help it. I mean, I just, I look like I was raped by Tektites. Jeez. Okay. Boom. And the water is going to rise. And we can now go in here. Because apparently it's going to be the last room. And sure enough, 
is. Well, that's for the boss, though. We're locked in. Switch. Now we get to the other side, though, but. Let's get these things out of the way first. Let's play these TEDx first. That way. They can just jump down there. Now let's not make sure they don't. Let's make sure they do not jump over the platforms. You know what I mean? See? Suck at you, Tektites, and your faces. So, where's their last closed hole? Is there? He is right there. The wall. There we go. And that just went right to the wall like he did last time. <laughs> yeah, last time it went through a wall too. Anyway, that's the last of the goals told us here. So we now we need to get our iron boots on. Go down here. Oh, look, shell blade. Probably the last one in the dungeon. And it's down. Yes. Okay. Let's take off our iron boots and go upwards because this is our last key. So what do we need the last key for anyway? I mean, what could possibly be in this room? The boss key. That makes a lot of sense. Oh, fairies. Two of them. Okay, they'll do the bolvers anymore, so. Fairy number four! Even though I should be doing fine, but. I could die at any time, guys. Anyway, boss key! The boss key is in here! Now I can get inside the chamber where the boss lurks. Alright. Anyway, make sure you're at level 3, because the that platform can only activate if it's at the third level. That's good thing to know. Seriously, I'm not kidding. Wait. Shell blade, really? Why is he right there? Anyway, let's go out where the rocks are coming out, because... Get moving. Hey, Tech Dykes! Come over here. Oh, no, no, no. You guys are not going to rape me. You guys are not going to rape me what you did last time. Seriously. Those stains are not going to rape me. How dare they try to rape me. Wait, oh, yeah, this place me all the way here. Jeez. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, my God. They just went all over here. Jeez. Also, yeah, I have to own just a wire level. Because I forgot. I've got just a wire level, so. This will probably be the last time we be in this room. Because up here is. Essentially, where our. Yeah. Now, in the remake, there are colored paths that allow you to move on. And not only that, the iron boots are like they were in Wind Waker. You know, where you had to um, press L and R instead of, like, pausing the game like this. Just to put them on, like this. See, that would, they made it a lot easier to use them. So, that's a good thing about Ocarina of Time. They just made it a little easier. Now, I think you have to use the fire to activate that um, torch. George opened that door, so that's that's why that's why I believe. Let's see. Oh yeah, the, the left door is where we need to go. Okay, just went under, not under the platform, onto the platform, please. Thank you. Open the door.
you're up. Come there, take eight. Yep. You knew you guys should rape me. I am not very happy with what they, those guys tried to rape me. Jeez. My god. Six of them just like, ultimately tried to rape me. Anyway. I want to explain something. You see, there's something about this last plot from Reno. Oh no, get away from me. Take that. Alright, there you go. Alright, now you see this? This is only up if the water is level 3. If it's not level 3, you can't move on. Let's get a fairy. Go up. Last chance to get a fairy. For the boss. Alright. Let's go in the last room for the boss. There is up there. Oh, jeez. This room. This room sucks. There are spike things. There are spike traps going moving back and forth. And if you hit by one of them, you have to go all the way down. Jeez. This room is a pain. No! No fair! See, that's pretty annoying. You have to go all the way down. It's annoying. It sucks. And you have to keep on moving. This is probably the most... My god. I thought it was like painless to the boss, but no, it has to be so painful. Seriously! How am I getting hit by these spike traps? I'm only about a few inches away from it. It was even worse. There is no long shot platform here. Seriously. Seriously, watch. Or maybe. Yes, seriously. There is no platform for long shots here. There is no switch. Yeah, it's even harder. You thought you used the hook shot, but no. You can't. There's no platform to use it for. Seriously! That last spike! My god! This puzzle is a pain in the ass. It really is. No, 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 no. Thank god. Alright. <clears throat> Let's fine face the boss. Hmm. Kaylin, look out! That's the normal water over there! Wait. Normal water? Where's this boss anyway? Jeez. Whoa. Okay. Why is this in normal water? Wait. Normal water? Who would this be boss enemy anyway? Like a fish? And a normal fish? Or something? Why does it say it's abnormal water? Hmm. I wonder why. What could possibly the boss this temple anyway? Wait, what? 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 Oh, whoa, whoa! Oh, jeez! What is that? That's giant aquatic amoeba. Morpha! So yeah, here we go, guys. This is the boss of the water temple. Um, Morpha. Master water temple. Yeah, that was a draw of water. Well, that's new as a tag. It's easy. You have to pull it out from the the water thing. Here guys, more is the nucleus, not the amoeba. No. Don't grab me. Let go of me, you amoeba. Destroy it like that and Bingo. That's how you do stuff. Okay. Alright, what we do is pull us out of the water. Come on. Get out of the water! Get out of the water! Get out of the water! No, no Morpha! Stay out of the water! Come on. Oh my god. We do is wait for the amoeba to come in. Watch this thing. Get it back. 
Then pull it out from the stack. I said pull it out! My! Yeah, that's how you do it. With five, it only takes five hits to kill it. Now, um, this thing can actually be easy to use a trick to beat this boss. What you do is pull it out, pull it over to a wall, <laughs> attack, attack it constantly. Now, but it does take five hits oh, anyway with the Great Orange Sword, so I have to do hits to it, so that makes everything fine. I mean, really. He only does double damage than a normal sword. Oh, come on. He's on this side. My god! Come on, Morpha! Get out of the water! Hold still! If you're gonna around, it's probably gonna be on Amiibo again, so take note of that. So, yeah, this is Rewar, it's part of the Amiibo. Wait for it, wait for it. And pull it over here to the wall. Tear the wall. Now, I'm not, okay, I'm not due to the trick, so what we do is need to keep this long shot over to the, to the wall and make sure it's okay for you. Then anyway, you just tag it and tag it and tag it and then it's dead. That's the fastest way to do this boss, but. Then again, I have to be on right anyway, so. Yeah, besides. I guess it's dead. Oh. Uh oh, here goes the last phase, where it just goes out of nowhere, and basically the Mila just comes down and never tries to attack you like that. But now there's two. Whoa! That's normal to them. So yeah, the Mercury is the point, and boom! It's dead. So yeah, that's the water tunnel, guys. So yeah, that's actually fake water. That's just, so there you go. There was the fake water and poof. There we go, guys. That's the end of Morpha. Alright. Now you can line stuff up if you want to. Right now, we gotta get this thing real quick. Our container. And now, we leave the Wire Temple. Completed? Yes. Alright. Go around and around and around and around and around and around. Chamber of the Sages. Ah, uh, Burrito. You're the sage, huh? How nice. Kill him! I would have expected no less from the man I chose to be my husband. The Zoros domain and its people will eventually return to their original state. As a reward, I grant my eternal love to you. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, that's what I want to say, but I don't think I can offer that now. Yeah. I have to guard the water temple as a stage of water. See, I know love. And you, you're searching for the Princess Zelda. Ha, you can't hide anything from me. <laughs> oh, jeez. Princess Zelda, she's alive. I can sense it, so don't be discouraged. I can tell that nothing will stop you in your quest for justice and peace. You must take this medallion. Take it respectfully. Okay, so here we go. We got ourselves... The Wata Medallion. How nice and cool. Yeah. So, real wing is the sage, and that's part of the oars. Let's see what he has to say for us. If you see Sheik, please give him my thanks, okay? Um, Sheik's a woman now? You realize that? Yes, I'm serious. Sheik's a woman. Anyway. 
Now the town has been defeated. Well, cleared. The lake is now going to raise back to its normal state. As the water rises, the evil is vanishing from the click. Hell, you did it. Sure did. Hey, Sheik. Did you really want to thank me? I see. We have to return peace to Hyrule for your search sake, too, don't we? Look at that, Kill. Huh. What is it? Together, you and Princess Rudo destroyed the evil monster. Once again, the lake is filled with pure water, always as it was here. Bingo. Ah, <sighs> Lake Halia. Back to normal. Time to the water table, which is awesome. Well, the original water table, though, not the other one. Wait, Sheik, where are you going? Oh, wait, where'd, he, where'd she go? Jeez. Sheik? Oh, I see, you're up there. <laughs> but we don't see him. Oh. Oh, oh. She's just diving into the water. Okay. Kind of weird. Anyway. Hmm. When water fills the lake, you have morning light. Thanks to late now. Yes, yeah, too late. Let's try this again. This time, let's try it when it's really morning. But first... Thanks to the long shot, we now get to higher places. Like, for example... I said, like, for example... We need this tree and get this gold taller right here. Die! This is gold taller. Die! Goodbye. Okay, so... Hold on a second, guys. I want to make sure I am good with Ghost of right here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Yes, we are. We got them all. Okay, guys. That's all for Ghost of in the... In Lake Aya. Yeah. Which is awesome. Yeah, we got the ones in the past and one now. Alright, so... Let's try this again. Wait for it, wait for it. Boom! Whoa. Um. Wait. What is that? <gasps> that arrow looks like this is a red crystal. Huh. I guess this is a very important item. Well, considering our arrows have, well, stuff in them, we might as well get this. And this is the fire arrow. Set the scene, your arrows will be powered up. If you hit your target, it will catch fire. Now, this has to be part there on the game, so take note of that. Anyway, our quest heart piece wise, we are getting close to finishing up all the heart pieces. Now, we could go here next, but we're supposed to go here next. Now, before we move on, um, I just gotta make check something about the our our progress in our heart pieces because we're going for them all. Hmm. I'm just talking about stuff. Oh, yeah! Almost forgot! 
We have to pay a visit back to a familiar place. So just to let you guys know, we're going to be child for the next part of the game. That's right. So, yeah. So allegedly, you remember that guy from the windmill? You know, the guy who gave us this song? Well, what if it's song is actually next time? But first, let's take off our Kiri to uh, Zora Tunic. So, hmm, I wonder what the Song of Storms could do. In fact, there's something we do with these six songs too. Yeah, these six songs are the point too, but this one also has the point. So, I wonder these two six these six songs have something to do with it. All right. So anyway, next time we're gonna go after our next prize. Hmm. We're gonna be in the childhood anyway. Well, not against hard pieces though. But yeah, seriously. Next time we're gonna do stuff involving the song of storms. Let's see your game. Again, next time. Where are we doing the Song of Storm stuff? So. We could do it for side quest, but. What kind song are we doing the plot? Well. The song's role in the plot will be revealed after some side quests. Well, it's just a side quest. But seriously, guys, you have to wonder. What could the posse be that we saw Storms for? Yeah, we'll have some next time. See you then, folks. Later. Also, War Temple... I'm glad to have been done you again. You are just a pain in this game. But the remix, not so much. Even though I'm not there yet. Because the Pokemon.